Hey guys, welcome to my first Sunday video. And today we're going to be doing a spin the wheel challenge. But we're taking it to the next level. We're going extreme. What can I say? Go big or go home. Now let's get into it. I was actually kind of really hoping for foam beads, so I'm kind of glad I got it. It's one of the easiest things. By the way, if you're curious, yes, I did have to make my wheel aesthetic. Okay, I'm actually kind of nervous for this one because I'm going to have to make a new slot. Okay, guys, let's get into it. So right here, I have my foam beads and my white base. Now I'm questioning if I should have added all those foam beads because we used up a lot. I have somewhat of an idea what kind of texture this is going to turn into, but with all these foam beads, it might turn into something different. I'm expecting it to be kind of crunchy, but the base that I'm using is kind of rippy, so that might change it. To change the texture up a bit, because I didn't really want to be boring, I used both sizes of foam beads. I used the tiny ones and the big ones. I'm so excited to mix this up, but I'm kind of afraid that all the foam beads are going to go everywhere. Wouldn't you be scared? Like, I've already cleaned up this studio once. Okay, so these are starting to go everywhere, and the slime is, like, barely picking up the foam beads. If you're doing this, I would recommend making the slime a little bit stickier so the foam beads get in the slime, because mine are kind of just falling out. After mixing them in, I completely regret what I said. The foam beads are amazing and they're picking up the slime very well. I did get one thing right though, the ASMR is really good. For reference, I grabbed the container. Now look at that tiny container compared to the slime. It is definitely grown with all the foam beads. One thing I didn't really expect was the fact that the slime was gonna change colors. The dye kinda came off the foam beads and made it like a purple color. So as you know, my next slime is extreme shaving cream, and for this slime, I'm going to have to make the slime. Not just add it in like the other one. So this one's going to be a lot more complicated. Okay, this is a little bit weird, but the shaving cream sp spraying ASMR is kind of good. Okay, I added way too much, I think, but I don't even know if this slime is going to activate properly. Let's hope. I'm adding a little bit more, but I guess I gotta say trust the process. Y'all, please don't hate. I know I'm using a pencil to mix this, but we'll do the exact same thing as a spoon can. So obviously, because we're going to have to make this slime from scratch, we're going to be using some activator. And for some reason, I thought this would be smart. Okay, finally I got that off. Now it's time to activate this thing properly. It's finally starting to come together, which I wasn't expecting, but for some reason it's feeling a little bit overactivated. I'm really confused. I am so, so happy this slime is starting to come together. I thought it was hopeless, but it is a little bit overactivated. But I can use it as a punching bag. Always look to the bright side. Yay, I finished. But this slime is way too basic for me. I thought I'd add something like, you know, a little bit of color. I added some really pretty pink food dye and it made a huge change. This slime is a lot less basic now. It kind of looks like cotton candy, not gonna lie. Okay, thank y'all for watching. Bye. Oh, and make sure to sub. Now, bye.